I'd like to raise today the issue, I suppose, of emergency accommodation for St. Teresa's Special School in Banlaslow. We only have about 115 special schools across the country. Um, but the challenge we have here, and it's linked to issues that I've raised already here in the House about Skull and Creenifi, the only Desh Band 1 school in Banlaslow, where they cannot handle, they have no capacity, they can't take on any other special needs class. Um, so St. Teresa's, which handles sort of moderate to profound children with, with moderate to profound, I suppose, com complex needs, has been taking the flack over the last number of years. Um, but they've gone from 11 students in 2011 to about 27 students last year. Um, and yet, they're in the same building and they've no space. There is no space. They've put forward an emergency application for two classrooms. Um, I've engaged with the department. I suppose I'd like to ask the leader of the house really to, just that we could see that this is accelerated. We're at the end of March already. It's causing a lot of stress and anxiety for principals. And I'm sure across the country, I know the department and their officials are dealing with hundreds of applications. Um, but and particularly facing COVID, I know there's been an impact and delays, but we really need to see that, that we could have a decision made so that there are 10 students I know that are awaiting enrolment in September. There's nowhere in Banastow for them to go. And it's not solely about that area in East Galway. That school caters again to people from Roscommon, East Galway. It, it captures and has a huge catchment area. Um, great staff doing great work, opened up their doors only a few weeks ago. And we know what a joy it was for children to be able to go back particularly when it impacted so much on their development. Um, and we know that there's great healthcare staff doing their best there. I'd really like to hopefully hear some sort of um, news in the next number of weeks to offer some relief, I suppose, to the principals to know that there's a plan in place for September. Thank you very um, much. Senator um, Dolan Ray, St. Teresa Special School in Ballinasloe. Uh, the very best I can offer you, Senator, is I can write to the Minister today and ask for an update on where the allocation or the negotiations for uh, extended accommodation for St. Teresa's is. And I'll send you a copy and a response once received from the Minister to your office um, immediately.